What would you consider to be the root of all evil? Some say it's money. But if you ask folks in the tire industry, it's incorrect inflation pressure on a customer's tires. In this video, let's talk about why improperly inflated tires are the root of all evil in the tire industry. Underinflated tires are still an all too common cause of tire failures, and incorrect tire pressure will lead to short and potential long term issues. For example, the wrong inflation can change the tire's footprint, causing too much flexing in the sidewall, creating additional unintended heat that can change the tire forever. This continual switch between excessive heating and cooling will cause the tire to break down prematurely. With all that being said, what can tire dealers do to combat the issue of underinflated tires? First, technicians should be vigilant and in not inflating hot tires or tires that just came off the road to the recommended cold inflation level. Wait until the tire has reached optimal atmosphere temperatures naturally. Then you can work on reaching the correct cold inflation pressure. If a hot tire is showing less than the recommended cold inflation pressure, that means it is underinflated. In this case, inflate it to the recommended cold inflation pressure plus 10 psi. The correct inflation pressure can then be reached after the tire cools off. To calculate the cold inflation pressure based on atmospheric temperatures, technicians should inflate tires to the recommended level when a tire matches the surrounding air temperature. Keep in mind though, altitude may have an effect on tire pressure, meaning there are differences in tires inflated at sea level compared to those above it. Remind customers that underinflated tires can cause reduced vehicle control, increased risk of a blowout, and less control in wet or icy conditions. Plus, think about it. What's the root of all evil for your technicians? Not having the time to work on other jobs in the shop. Customers who have under or overinflated tires require more tedious jobs for technicians, like having to align, balance, or inflate tires. Yes, these are important service items, but time is money. And the less time your technicians have to work on other vehicles in the shop, the worse for your bottom line. For more tire and service videos, don't forget to follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube. I'm Christian Hinton, coming to you from the Tire Review Continental Tire Garage Studio at Babcock's Media. Thanks for watching.